Okay. Hi. So I took the plunge, as you can see, shaved my head. And I will be completely honest, it wasn't something that I was planning on doing. Um, but I did have a hairdresser disaster. Asked the lady to take off that much. She took off about that much when I had short hair already. So now I decided shave the head, take the plunge. And it's been met with really good welcome as well. And people have been saying how it's made my face look pretty and uh, that I suit it. And that they would never have guessed that I was naturally blonde. There's a bit sticking up there. Um, yeah, so it's been met with good, good feedback. I kind of thought people were going to laugh, to be honest, at first. I mean, you kind of expect it. Um, no, people have been rather nice. Maybe not the family as much, <laughs> and they see me as that little girl still with the long blonde hair, so it was a bit of a thing for them. Uh, yeah, so it, it's it been good, and it's really freeing. I mean, it's taken about half an hour off my, like, getting ready time in the morning, and I don't have to worry on a night time. I can have a shower on a night time if I want to instead so of the morning, So because I, I don't have to worry about my hair sticking up at all different angles. Um... But yeah, yeah, it's been good. Um, it's made me have to rethink what I do with my makeup. I uh, will be honest about that. I mean, I talked to a lot of people before I got it done, and they said you don't have to alter your makeup if you really don't want to. But when I did it, I realised it was making me look like like it was costume makeup, like I was getting ready for a show, and it was not right. Um, so I had to make it a bit more neutral and bring more attention to lips and eyes than to the rest of my face, which was interesting. Um, and I also found that I can wear big earrings. I mean, I'm not wearing them today, but I bought, my, bought myself a pair of big hoops from Primark, big silver hoops. I figured since Jessie J could wear them when she had bald head, I thought, why not? Give it a go. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's made me rethink a couple of things about how I dress too, it, it, which is weird because I mean it's just just hair. It's it's something that isn't. Well, it can it can be nothing to do with your clothes. I mean, your clothes are a person part of your person. So yeah, I shaved my head, and then suddenly I'm starting to wear brighter clothes, different style clothes. Um, one thing I did find was that my lipstick was getting brighter. I mean, at months when I had hair, I never would have had this pink lip gloss and now I absolutely love it um it has opened my eyes to having to take very good care of your skin um and things like that that is one thing so I've been getting a lot of water now because you know I noticed how much my skin was like combination skin it had like dry and then oily and then <clears throat> made me have to concentrate on how well you do your makeup up into your hair that's that's the one I didn't think about because when you have your hair over your like I had a fringe before like complete full fringe, side fringe sort of thing, and um, yeah yeah I didn't realize how much you really need to be careful about how you put your bronzer and your con contouring up into your hairline, um because it can look absolutely fake if you don't. I mean I don't know if I've got the achieved look or anything but I quite like it. Um, but yeah, now I'm having to take it right up into the hairline because there's no hiding it anymore. That is the one thing. Your face is completely on display. There's no hiding anything. Um, and yeah, you're going to get a couple of looks from people and then other people are going to say you're so brave and that you, and that you really, you've done a step that they can never do. I mean, I was in the pub the other day. Great inspirational story. Uh, and the lit and the bar lady, even she was like, you know what? Seeing you with your hair like that. It's kind of made me want to do it myself. And that was nice to hear. Instead of people just saying, oh, yeah, that's nice. Um, and not knowing what they actually think. Because, yeah, sure, people can say one thing and mean another. But when a woman says that she wants to do it and do it herself, but she's not brave enough. I mean, it's is, it is nice to hear that like people are more open now to a woman having a shaved head. It's really cool. It's been really cool. I, mean, I did get one person asking me if I was ill. Um, but they laughed and walked on, so they weren't anything. That's the only thing I think I found that was a tiny bit upsetting. Um, 
but yeah, that was the only thing really. And even then, they were just immature people, um, laughing at something they shouldn't be laughing at, to be honest. Um, but no, a lot of women wear their hair like this now, and I think it's actually quite nice. It's a little bit different. I think it's weird because having long hair, you really look feminine. And I found with me with short hair, I didn't look feminine hardly at all. But then shaved my head and I looked more feminine than when I had a tiny a little bit of hair. So that that was a strange one for me. But it was <laughs> it was good though. It was it was it kind of I don't know, it made me think about a whole new way of looking at myself. And that and wasn't just my hair, because my hair used to be one of my biggest insecurities. If my hair didn't used to look right, I wasn't interested in going out. I wouldn't go out if it, it's like hair dye. I damaged my hair so much with hair dye over the last 10 years and now I don't even have to worry about it. I mean, I'm natural now. It's This is my natural colour. I mean, I know it's uh, just because of the lighting in the video because it's, it's sunny in the window. Um, it's a little bit more honey coloured, but it's naturally um, ash and it's nice to see. See, I can just run my hand through it now and nothing, nothing, no change or anything, which is really cool. Uh, yeah, so that's good. It's good. And I would encourage more people to do it actually, because it's really freeing, and it and it gives you a whole new look on yourself, on on life. To be honest, because it's opened my eyes. It really has really opened my eyes. To <laughs> sorry, just noticed that my eyes are like, really wide. There's like, <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's opened my eyes to what people can perceive as beauty, and how you feel about yourself, and that. Things like hair can be just such a mundane thing that we spend too much time worrying about. So yeah, I don't know whether I'll be growing it back yet. Um, maybe after some time I might try after the summer when it gets a bit more to winter time and I need a bit of uh, warmth on my head. But right now with the summer and the sun shining the way it is, uh, I think I'll just leave it. I quite like it. And I can wear big earrings with it. That's something I've never had before. But obviously not wearing them now again. Uh, but might go put them on now, actually. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So that's me on my head shave. And I'll see you next time with another life-altering life-altering thing. And yeah, see you later.